Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Finally, OnePlus have rolled out its final developer preview based on Android 11 for OnePlus 8 and 8 Pro. In this video, we'll take a look what all new features have been added on latest Android 11 developer preview. Before that, if you guys haven't subscribed to our channel, make sure to subscribe and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. So right now you can see here I have my OnePlus 8 and on this I am running the stable version of Oxygen OS which is 10.5.10. You can download the Android 11 developer preview from the description below. Make sure to charge your device more than 30% and also take backup of your device before installing Android 11 developer preview 3 which is a final version. Once you are done with that you need to place that file inside the internal storage. So here we have the file. Avoid placing it inside any folder. After that you have to go to settings, system system update tap on the gear icon towards the right top corner select local upgrade and you need to choose the file we'll select the file once you tap on the file you get a message that it won't affect your data but for safety purpose make sure to take a backup of your device tapping on install now installation might take around five to six minutes once installation process is completed you can reboot your device device have been successfully booted up first of all let me show you the software information by going to settings and we'll have almost same features what we got on hydrogen os a completely redesigned settings panel going to about and here you can see device is oneplus 8 android version is android 11 build number is oxygen os developer preview 3 inside android version security patch is 5th august 2020 and with android 11 developer preview 3 we get the new easter egg logo so finally we have received the final build of android 11 developer preview for oneplus 8 series now whatever updates we'll be getting based on android 11 will be open beta so we'll cover all the changes what they have done with the latest android 11 developer preview 3 so this will be your first look of android 11 developer preview 3 there are lots of customizations and ui changes have been done with this latest build and everything is similar to hydrogen os yesterday oneplus unveiled a lot of changes with hydrogen os so the same changes have been added with oxygen os also this is a quick setting panel which is again redesigned at the bottom you get the data usage on top you get date and day talking about the launcher version here launcher version is version 5.0 with this launcher they have done few changes like now we get a new option when you select swipe down to access initially we had notification and quick setting but now they have also integrated shelf for swipe down to access so let's select this and once you swipe down you can see this is the new and redesigned shelf if you talk about the camera version, camera version have been updated now which is version 5.4.56 under which they have added focus tracking for video recording and that seems to be working great. I'll be making a dedicated video on all the latest features added on Android 11 for OnePlus devices. You won't find much of difference in the app drawer. But if you take a look at the new power control and here we have a similar power control what we get on Pixel devices. And with this latest build we get a new option for screenshots. So whenever you are taking any screenshot, you can long press that and you will get few options to share it on your social media platforms. Now let's go inside the settings and here you can see now settings panel is completely redesigned and now it's similar to one UI which makes very easy to use the device with one hand. Same goes with the other system application like phone, messages and gallery. Calling UI have also been redesigned. You'll obviously see changes with the lock screen also. Now let's talk about the change logs of latest Android 11 developer preview which says new visuals including weather app, launcher, gallery and notes. So first let's take a look at the weather application and here you can see lots of UI changes have been done with the weather application. Launcher changes I've already shown you. Going inside the gallery app, with the latest gallery app now we get three sections. First one is photos, second one is collection and the third one is explore. Talking about the next change log which says new layout for comfortable and convenient one hand operations. So which I've already shown you with the redesigned UI. Now you can easily access your entire device large screen with one hand. After that they have also added the always on display function with new 11 clock styles and this was one of the most awaited feature on oneplus devices. So this can be found inside the settings, display, ambient display and here we have an option of always on in which you can schedule the always on display by setting the custom time or you can always keep it on throughout the day and here is a first look at always on display.
and with the always on display they have added new 11 clock styles in which one of my favorite one is this insight this always on style will give you lots of information about your usage pattern how many times you have unlocked the device and this clock also goes down as the day passes another thing what oneplus haven't mentioned in the change logs is now they have added a new live wallpaper so this is that live wallpaper and this wallpaper will change color as per sunrise or sunset Talking about the next change log in which they have added new OnePlus San font that improves readability. So yes, they have added a new font also which can be again found inside the customization section under fonts and here you can find the newly added font. After that they have optimized the dark mode including ability to automatically turn on and turn off and also a shortcut have been added. So yes, you can find that shortcut here inside the quick setting panel. Here we have the first look of dark mode on OnePlus. 8 series. You can also customize the dark mode by going to display settings where we get options like manual, you can set the custom time range or automatic based on sunrise or sunset. If few apps are not being supported by dark mode, you can force them by enabling dark tone in more apps. So all the applications which are functioning and which are not functioning will be listed here. And then talking about the next change log which is related to Zen mode where they have added new three themes, more time option and a new group feature. So let's go to Zen mode. So here they have added three different themes. Also you can choose the max time up to 120 minutes. And if your friends have OnePlus device, you can also add your friends by creating a room or you can join their room if someone have created. And the last change log which is related to gallery which says new gallery function that automatically creates a weekly story based on your photos and videos. So here under gallery they have added a new function which will create weekly stories based on your photos and videos. So guys these were the complete change logs of Android 11 developer preview 3 which is in final build. We'll have a dedicated video in which we'll cover almost all the new features added on Oxygen OS Android 11. Now let's talk about the benchmark results. With Geekbench application single core have scored 898 and multi core have scored 3216. With Antutu benchmark application device have scored 578,212. And guys I've used hydrogen OS 11 which was released yesterday I did not find any kind of major bugs on that on this if I find any bugs I'll let you know in the comment section below so guys that was a quick look on the latest Android 11 developer preview for OnePlus 8 and 8 Pro if you still have any kind of questions you can let me know in the comment section below this is your friend Ashok signing out see you guys in the next video